Measuring your vehicle for a custom California car cover is simple and straightforward. All you'll need is some painter's tape, pen, tape measure, and one of our recommended dimension sheets. We have a library featuring thousands of custom car cover patterns, so we usually do have patterns available for all the new and classic cars on the road. Should we not have a car cover pattern available for your vehicle, we can fax or email you a dimension sheet to complete. After reviewing the dimension sheet, place small pieces of painter's tape on the noted points along the vehicle that you need to measure. This will help you keep the measurements and reference points consistent. Once all of the pieces of tape have been placed, you can start to take measurements of the vehicle's length. Following along with the dimension sheet and reference points, take measurements at point 1, and point 2, and point 3, and so on until all of the lengths on the dimension sheet have been completed. Make a note of each measurement in the corresponding space on the dimension sheet. Be sure to measure from the proper points and do not overlap measurements. Use the painter's tape as a reference to ensure that all the measuring points start and end at the correct places. Measuring around angled windshields and curved fenders might appear difficult, but it is not. Just check your measuring points and make a note of the lengths. The most important thing to remember is consistency. If you measure from the same points, the calculations will be much more accurate as you move along. Once all the lengths have been measured from front to back, it would be time to obtain the overall length of the vehicle. Measure the vehicle from bumper to bumper. The overall length measurement will check your measurements for accuracy. Now it is time to do some math. The sum of the length measurements should be equal to the overall vehicle length. If not, then check your measurements and correct errors before proceeding. You might need to measure some parts of the vehicle again to confirm. Once the two numbers are equal, you can then move on to do the heights. Measure the heights at the corresponding letters on the dimension sheet. Moving from front to back, measure from the ground to point A, point B, and so on until all points have been collected. The final height measurement will be road clearance. That is the measurement from the ground to the lowest point at the middle of the car. Once all of the heights have been collected, it will be time to measure the widths. At the same letter points that you measure the heights, measure the widths across the vehicle. The dimension sheet will ask you for specific measurements depending on the type of vehicle being measured. If you are measuring the car by yourself, you can often measure to the midpoint of the vehicle and double the total if you cannot reach across the vehicle. Just make sure that you have accurately identified the midpoint. Once the measurements have been collected and the dimension sheet completed, simply send back the form to us with your order. Within a month, you will receive your custom fit California car cover. For more product information or order inquiries, please contact California Car Cover or visit calcarcover.com.